Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to Hasib Electronics. Friends, I have this HDMI receiver, satellite receiver. It is not power on. Always use isolation transformer and series lamp. It have no display. Set voltmeter to AC. We will check AC voltage 233 volt. Now check voltage across the fuse. It is 233. That means the fuse is open. If the fuse is open, it will drop the maximum voltage and it will not allow to pass the voltage to the next circuit. So first of all, we have to see why the fuse is damaged. If we see the fuse glass is broke broken so we have to replace the fuse so this fuse is 3.15 ampere 250 volt so i have to remove this So I removed the fuse. Now before installing this fuse, I will use a fuse wire. It is bus fuse wire, 1 ampere. So I will use a piece of wire so that other than to destroying a new fuse, we have to troubleshoot. So now I connected fuse wire. Now check input resistance. At AC input terminal, it's high resistance, that means it's safe. Set multimeter to diode mode to verify the bridge rectifier. At capacitor, positive terminal. Connect black lead. Check at input terminal, one diode available, second diode available. Swap lead to the negative terminal of the capacitor. It should open, so it is open. That's good. Now, swap lead red lead to the negative terminal of the main DC capacitor. It's okay. It should forward bias. And now move red lead to positive terminal of the capacitor. It should open. So it is open. That's nice. Now the receiver is turned on. And the voltage are stable. So it is powered on. So if found the problem the fuse was just open the burnout there was no solid reason to burn out the fuse sometime it happens so I have this fuse the same value
Jordan it selected the channel Jordan so that means it is working it's good click the like button if you have not subscribed my channel subscribe it if you want to watch my future videos press bell icon button thanks for watching assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh